Jeffrey Bastard here behind the camera is telling us we look good. How, how good do we look right now? I can't tell you. We need to ask someone else on the other side of the camera. I think we just look too good to look at each other. Anyways, Justin Lofton right here, driver of the number 88 Auto Club late model for PCM. Now, let's talk about your late model race right now. Kind of a little rough one. <laughs> yeah, they were uh, kind of picking on me a little bit, but then again, I was being probably a little more aggressive than I should have. But, hey, you know what? It was absolute awesome to be able to come back out here. I been, haven't been out here since 2005. Paul gave me the opportunity to come drive a second late model, and you know what? We've got him really hooked up, and it won't be long before you see myself or Miles in victory lane in one of them. For you that don't know, he used to be a regular out here in the number 66 Lofton Cattle Ride. Yeah, that's uh, it's actually where I started my circle track career coming out of the off-road world, and uh, you know, it's catapulted me. I'm running the 2009 ARCA Remax Series leading the points right now, and you know, it's all thanks to Toyota Speedway. Now let's talk about ARCA now. First race, Daytona, and a lot of people want to know what was going on. I was asking the same thing. I mean, Mike Kellenoff and myself are going back and forth, and we're just kind of like, this is a mess. But uh, you know what? It, that's kind of what the ARCA Remax series is for, is for people to learn, and there was a lot of mistakes made on a lot of people's parts. And uh, you know what? I think it's made a lot of people better because of it. It's really helped out the Remax series as far as safety and uh, you know making sure people are qualified to do what they do you know either be a spotter or a driver and you know what that's it's a learning experience and you know what they're really doing a really good job at uh, making up for it one thing way cool about the arc division you guys not only run daytona talladega pocono a dirt track a lot of short tracks yeah the arca remax series has a lot of adverse tracks uh we're going to rockingham next week which is absolutely a phenomenal racetrack and never should have been taken off the sprint cup schedule uh then after that we're going to mansfield ohio or toledo ohio where uh, I have the track record right now and led 125 laps there at the last race and blew a tire at the end of it. Um, we go to a dirt, we go to two dirt tracks in August, and then we go to a New Jersey Motorsports Park, which we did really well there until we ended up blowing the motor up. But uh, the Arca Remax Series does a, is an awesome series. A uh, lot of adversity, a lot of you know young young and up and comers, and a lot of you know old legends. Frank Kimmel is absolutely awesome. He's been a mentor to me and really been helping me out there. Well, one thing is a lot of fun watching you guys on speed, especially you, because you're our hometown guy. Yeah, I'm. I'm glad to have all you guys, all the fans, and everything. That's uh, really why I do it. I mean, it'd be no fun if I was just out there racing for myself. All right, let's hear about who helps you out. Uh, we got my family's been the biggest supporter. Uh, Lofton Cattle, Eddie Sharp has been absolutely phenomenal uh, to me. Um, Klotz, Cometic, uh, just Toyota, TRD, Triad. I uh, just have a lot of people. Mark Rett, my new crew chief in the ARCA Remax series, has just done a phenomenal job. Uh, Paul out here in Late Malls has done a good job. And, you know, they've been uh, pretty much main supporters. Anytime I'm down, I call them up, and they always build me back up. So there's a lot of good people, and I just, I mean, it's hard to name them all. And, you know, just, it's uh, really grateful for every one of them. All right. Justin Lofton, one more question. Easter Sunday tomorrow, what's the plans? Um, I really don't know. We're Gonna go. Uh, gonna stay the night here and go back to San Diego and hopefully the sun comes out so I go to the beach for a little bit since uh, Charlotte really doesn't have one. So, <laughs> all right, everybody. Justin Lofton drove the '88 Paul Copenhaver Motorsports Auto Club late model.